Now that we've heard everything that the solo oboe is capable of, it's time to explore what can be done with multiple oboes. Certainly, the second oboe and English horn and Viet Quang suite are technical matches to the original soloist. However, to have all three musicians play music like Durati's five pieces simultaneously would be, if I'm being perfectly honest, a bit much. This is the fine line that Quang suite walks working to explore every possible sound that can be made by this combination of instruments without abandoning the piece's clarity. Thus, each movement is an exploration of the very dynamic capabilities of each instrument within the context of an ensemble. This description makes the piece sound a bit dull and academic, perhaps, but the music itself is anything but. Kuang's music dances, soars, and grooves, with the different instruments passing musical ideas to one another, almost talking to each other. Here, the ensemble itself is turned into a living being, ever-changing and always moving forward.